Hi guys and welcome to another video for the Q&A section. This time I'm going to answer um, another question from Canadifan. He uh, asked, um, first of all, how we can open um, Notepad++ in this case as the default editor when you right click on, on, a, on an auto hotkey file and select the option to edit. This will work with um, any any editor, if you if you're using anything else um, instead of Notepad++, the solution that I'm going to be giving in here is going to work for any of them. And he also had another um, question, which is how to set the default Notepad language to Auto Hotkey. Well, that one is not totally um, you know Auto Hotkey related because it is a configuration for the Notepad++ editor. But I'm going to answer it anyways because um, it is to set it up to the auto hotkey language itself. So in here we're going to have a, we have a a new document, auto hotkey document. And when you right click on edit, this is what happens. It opens with Notepad, um, and you want it to open with your default editor. So um, sometimes the editors do not override, which is your default, you know, program for handling the TXT files and stuff. And in this case, Notepad plus plus is not doing that. So the quick solution is to go to the run. Um, command and then you put regedit in there. Now, it, the registry editor is um, for advanced users, so you might want to make a backup of the registry before you continue. But the changes that I'm going to do do not mess with anything that has to do, you know, with the important files from the computer. So basically, you just go to the H classes route in which you can check all the file extensions that you have. And if you type .ahk, you will see that the AHK file is handled by the auto hotkey script key. That that name in here is one of the keys in here in this list. We're going to just simply type auto hotkey script and as you can see we have a key in here which contains the actions, for example the default icon and the default actions that is going to be um, performed on that particular kind of file. For example it's compile it, edit it, or open it. And as you might no, well, we're gonna go and change the add command because in here, as you might see in there, the default is notepad.exe. So just basically just go ahead, grab your program files notepad plus plus folder, copy the address in here, then put notepad plus plus.exe. And then this is a trick, you have to put percent one in quotes because um, if you do not put the quotation marks um, Notepad++ is not going to understand the the, um, the path of your file because it contains usually spaces so when, when you put it within quotes it usually works fine after you did that particular change you can just simply close regedit a lot of people tell you to restart, you don't have to, you simply click edit script and there you go, you have your um, default editor opening that particular kind of file. There are some other ways to do it, the, more, the, the safer way is to go by tools, folder options, file types, but sometimes I find that I cannot access some options over here, that's why I use the registry editor. So that was the first question, that was simple. The second one is simple as well. Um, to configure Notepad++ in this particular case to have AutoHotKey as the default language, you must have the language installed, of course, and second, you just go to the preferences, and if I remember correctly, um, we have in here, in the new document and default directory, the option to set the default language, and at the bottom, you will see auto hotkey. Um, usually I have it as normal text because what happens is the following. When you go to the styler configuration and you go to the auto hotkey option, you can set which um, extensions are by default from auto hotkey. So if you say, um, as you can see the AHK extension is already there, which means that whenever I open an AHK file, the language is going to jump automatically to auto hotkey because of the file extension but if I have a new 
file and let's say that the um, extension let me see no let me see the extension of this file is let's say cat yes oh that is from windows let's say lls yeah a stupid one so we have the lls file extension that is not recognized by windows you can go ahead and set the preferences in here in the style configurator and in auto hotkey you can set the option lls save and close when you open this file and you open it for example with notepad plus plus by using the default methods um, you can select that always use it or whatever and when you open it the language is going to be set up automatically to auto hotkey because you're telling the styler configurator to look for those f to those file extensions and when you have that file extension opened by notepad plus plus it automatically is going to assign that particular language so basically that's the way that you do those two things and i hope this is helpful so with this i'm going to finish this particular section this particular video for the q a see you again next time and keep asking questions that i'm going to be trying to answer them all